have spent over a thousand dollars on just fancy goldfish. What's up guys, welcome back to my channel. So thank you so much for clicking, showing love on my literal previous video because I just got back and I will post every freaking Sunday, okay? I want to show you guys today my entire goldfish collection because why the heck not? And I'll be showing you guys where I get them. I'll talk about everything, okay? How did I get into fancy goldfish? Well, one of my plant friends actually that I've known for a couple years, uh, we've gotten closer and she kind of convinced me to just try it out and they were just really cute. All of them look entirely different, shapes, sizes, colors. I've never seen goldfish like this before no you cannot get these anywhere at like actual pet stores it's really aesthetically pleasing i also collect rare exotic plants so really good for natural fertilizer using the water but yeah i just like trying new things and i'm a cancer so like that nurturing tree it just comes natural to me you know what i mean where do i get the fancy goldfish well first of all i have a couple that i actually shop at goldfish island jy aquarium choo choo goldfish and king koi and no <laughs> this video is in no shape or form sponsored by any of these. It's just the real truth coming out and my recommendations. My favorite though, my all-time favorite, probably Choo Choo Goldfish and JY Aquarium. They breed like top tier, like high quality. You're probably thinking how much each goldfish kind of costs or you know, how much have I spent? I've spent a couple thousand dollars already within the past two months just on fancy goldfish material. Mr. Chubbs kind of floating around. <laughs> It ranges between $50 to like over $1,000. The most expensive I've personally bought is $700 and that includes shipping and um, yeah, just overnight shipping. I always, I always overnight my fish because I don't want it to die, okay? My cheapest, probably $109, which is like a baby one. It's like three and a half inches. Yeah, that's basically it. Let me show you guys around and stop rambling. Let's go. So this is my goldfish collection, my dresser. 26 gallon all this tank. This little gal, her name is Gia. She is a Thai Aranda rose tail. This is my JY Aquarium from the NK Farms. Um, he's super rare. This is a $700 one. I named him Loki, and he is a Thai Aranda Panda Orchid tail. Her name, okay, is Jinju, and she is a Blue Lavender Ranchu. Um, she's pretty dark, but she's lightened up. You can tell with the whole gold belt. You know, she's fancy or whatever. Goldfish Island, her name is Bunny the Ranchu. This guy is a heavy ink ranchu from JY Aquarium, and I haven't really named him yet. I think I'm just gonna name him Mr. Chubbs. I'm gonna show you the 20G tank, and like I said, okay, they're happy in the environment, and the water levels are completely fine. By the way, I am not adding any more fish. This is a temporary setup. This is a temporary setup, okay, until I move out. So I'm gonna show you guys what it looks like. This is my 20G tank. Um, I currently have one, two, three, four filters. Two sponge filters, one canister, and one hang on the back. Her name is Miss Piggy, um, AKA Unji. It's a Korean name. She is a milk cow tricolored ranch from Goldfish Island. Her name is Miss Ma'am. She's from Chuchu Goldfish. And yes, she is supposed to be like this with the bulging eyes and the bulging belly. Miss Girl, who is also from Chuchu Goldfish. Um, and she's Sakura. Um, colored patterned. I just love this like simplistic setup. It's really clean. Lately, I've been doing water changes every day. I think that's all that I want to like show you guys today. Let me know what you guys think, which one's your favorite. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment down below. All my socials are linked, and I want to thank you guys so much for watching because I'm jump starting my YouTube, and I'm gonna post every freaking Sunday. So stay tuned. Bye, love ya.